And Sacramento County DA Anne Marie Schubert is calling the early release of a convicted felony DUI driver outrageous. Ronnie Ward may end up serving less than half of his sentence for a crash that severely hurt a real Linda woman and led to the death of her baby RJ. I spoke with her tonight about her plea to keep the driver in prison. It's hard um, dealing with this. It's very emotional. Sierra Viegas learned the man responsible for a horrific crash that severely injured her and ultimately killed her baby RJ is going to be released early from prison, according to the CDCR. I feel like I'm just going through it over again. Ronnie Ward III was convicted and sentenced to six years in prison in 2019 for felony DUI causing injury and an enhancement for causing Sierra Viegas to suffer great bodily injury. It should have been manslaughter instead of a DUI. The Sacramento County District Attorney's Office said they could not charge Ward with manslaughter because California law does not include the death of a fetus in its definition of manslaughter or vehicular manslaughter. RJ survived only two days after an emergency C-section. Viegas had a long road to recovery herself. And I remember the very first interview that I had with you, it was hard for me to talk because of my brain injury. Now, following the news of his early release, the DA's office sent a letter to the CDCR parole administrator asking for Ward to be denied early release. Schubert wrote in part, It is outrageous that a chronic alcoholic who killed an unborn child and nearly killed the baby's 31-year-old mother is set to be released after serving two and a half years of a maximum six-year sentence. It's not right. While Sierra works to get the word out about this latest news, she is holding on to hope. Sierra's daughter, Aria, was born six months ago. Her due date was her late son RJ's birthday. My daughter is the only thing basically that keeps me going right now. So why is he being released? Well, according to the CDCR, Ward earned enough credits to grant him early release. He also earned credits for completing an associate's degree while incarcerated. Meanwhile, Madison, I understand Sierra is trying to turn her anger into something positive and keep this from happening to others. Yes, yeah, she is. Sierra is partnering with Mothers Against Drunk Driving this weekend. They're hosting a community walk in Roseville to bring awareness to the dangers of drinking and driving. And now, Chris, she says she's feeling even more fuel to make sure no one else feels her pain. Mm,